Welcome to Mind Flows. Today, we will talk about the subitem filter on Monday.com. While your boards fill up with a ton of information, you can easily filter it using our subitem filters to find the precise information you require from the subitems you have on your board. So let's get going. First, we'll take a look at the subitems available on our board. These are the information that we have the subitem owner, the status progress for each subtask deadline and the subtasks priority and complexity level. To filter an information that you only want to see within the board, just go to the upper left of the screen and click on the drop down arrow filter and be redirected to the advanced filtering. Go to the bottom where you can find the sub item columns. In this example, let's try to filter the people column and set it to where the owner of the subtask is Dan. Now it will only show all subtasks where the owner is Dan. Let's delete the previous filter by clicking X at the right side. And let's try to filter another subitem column. This time we want all subtasks in medium priority. We can also play around other filters like the complexity level and do the same process as what we did earlier. To save the filters, just click the Save as New View button at the top right. If we want to delete the filter, we will just click X and click the Save as New View button once again. The same sub-item filter applies to the all different views on our board. We have a Kanban view here as an example. We only want our Kanban view to show all completed subtasks. We do the necessary procedure in setting the filter. As easy as that. You can save time navigating your boards using the board filters by using the sub-item filters to make inferences, concentrate on what's important, and make decisions. Follow us for more Monday.com tutorials. We're MindFlows, a certified Monday.com partner.